Can trust the police, Adler? This guy's done more for less. He'll look the other way. Adler? Glad you could join us, Hans. You remember Mason. We cleared a move on the target. Kasim is in his apartment, but he's well protected. Can keep my men out of the area for 15 minutes. I hope you brought an army. We brought enough. Pleasure doing business with you, Hans. Come on. Woods is itching for a dust dump. We don't want to let him down. We're on the clock, Woods. Let's not keep the scene waiting. Hey, Mason. Party favors are in the trunk. Dipshit probably thinks he's safe. That piece of trash is a lot of things. But safe ain't one of them. Do we really need to take this son of a bitch alive, Adler? Kazim has info we need. Everyone else can take a powder. Apartment's just up ahead. Hans only bought us 15 minutes. We need to hit Kasim hard and fast. Let's go. Let's help him ring in the new year. Light up. Go, go, go! Kasim's headed up the stairs! Handle the money? I have no idea where Arashi is. I don't think you understand the situation. Americans ah! have rules. You have rules. You took hostages. The rules changed. Wait, wait, wait. He's in Turkey. He's meeting someone in Trap Zone Airfield tomorrow night. I swear, I swear I don't know. They only communicate with coded messages. 
This is not fuck. All right, let's load him up. He'll find his voice soon enough. Let me know if you need some help looking for it. Hudson, we're bringing you a present. He's in Trap Zone, Turkey. Airfield's just up ahead. Let's go find this shithead. Priority is to ID a Raj before things go hot. Perseus is dead. Dead? 
<laughs> All this time and you didn't even know. <laughs> Precious will watch the west back. Hudson don't want to hear about this. Let's sweep the tarmac for survivors and get to Langley. Who the fuck is Perseus? Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig, allow me to introduce the man best suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer, Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? You don't have to, sir. <laughs> yeah. Then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it's shifted the balance of the Cold War. After 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that will affect the free world. President, this is Jason Hudson and Russell Adler. I know their names. Who do you think approved their last mission? Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular. Most likely illegal if the press gets a hold. What the hell are you talking about? You know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant Woods, plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task, protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, Rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. Yes, sir, I'm on it. from green light didn't tell us what else are you hiding maybe i can knock the truth out of you you might want to rethink that woods everybody stand down this little pissing match isn't going to help us catch perseus why didn't you tell us it was an american nuke he needed us to clean up his mess the bastard's been lying to us all along it's not a lie it's an omission of fact that's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced that the Reds moved on Europe. We couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight, a top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. 74 of the bombs were upgraded to high yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. You're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people, but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? 
One of the green light nooks went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So, there's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Killed Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods. The first building is just over that ridge. Thanks, Dimitri. We'll radio and we found the mainframe. Woods, you know what the KGB does to double agents. Yep. Duh. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. Hey, I've only one hour of fuel. So after that, you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's get moving, Mason. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar fool you. Dimitri's kosher enough. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Hell, he buried half of them. Scouts on the ridge line. We should drop them now before we get any closer. Good kill. Nice. Let's keep moving. You take one, I'll get the other. Damn, Mason, save some for me. Yeah, this looks dicey. But hey, if it's good enough, the Reds. <laughs> you go first. Time to pay Ivan a visit. Looks like it's hanging by a thread. Let's keep moving.
my damn gun. I see a tunnel down here. You'll have to find another way inside. Copy that. Stay sure. Woods. Место было заброшено после схода лавины. Я слышал, что при раскопках были найдены тела с пулевыми ранениями. Ты что, хочешь сказать, что наше начальство скрыло вражескую атаку на советской земле? Разве здесь есть что-то важное? Не вижу ничего ценного. Здесь тихо. Нужна помощь. А! Вот он, он, он. Мне вот нужно подкрепление! I'm surprised the entire Soviet Union ain't up our ass. You've been busy. That's what they pay me for. In here, Chief. You see any dig sites? If I'm reading this map right, swing a few degrees to your left, more north. here for more than just the mainframe. Steiner was working on all sorts of crazy shit. That Nova 6 business was just the tip of the iceberg. Looks like they're packing up and getting ready to move out. There. What's that? Bingo. That crane matches the dick site on this map. There's a big crane on the west side of the base. Have your winch ready. That's where we need to go. Excuse me? My, my winch? Sorry, I'm breaking up. This is the wrong way.
Rebase it! Gotta rebase it! We gotta get down there, now! Is the mainframe big? Because if it's too big, we can't lift off. Can you avoid the facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods! Don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my surest shit guaranteed. Now have a while. What's up? I need a few minutes of your time to discuss it. It's all getting stuff available. ready to roll. You ready? Let's talk. You look ready. Yeah. Check this out. Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Well. Are you fucking serious right now? Don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on. Let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so yeah, Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That sent a tidal wave of shit all the way up to D.C. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head, well, I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. No, we were after a different spying case, huh? That's right. Our team was right next to Adler's when we touched down in Way City. That's also the first time I had the misfortune of meeting Hudson. <laughs> in all those years, nothing's changed. He still has the personality of a wet fucking blanket. <laughs> you
You hear that? We're fucking legends. Yeah. Wherever we go, we bring the thunder. Man, get the fuck out of here with that shit. You seem pretty unimpressed over in Fake Town, USA. Or... Are you talking about Mason right now? As I live and breathe. You got a point in saying that? You sound concerned too. If you're trying to be friendly, this is the dumbest way to go about it. We're just fucking with you. <laughs> <laughs> you should be concerned. Yeah, well, you just snuck into the KGB with Adler, hacked their database, and got out in one piece. And I'll be going in with my boy here. If I were Perseus, I'd be running for the hills. And I'd be calling in a mortar strike on that hill. Yeah, for Adler, it's a culmination of three decades of meticulous tracking. He'll probably be extra pissy on this mission. I advise you to stay focused and drop the nostalgia. Good. Then you're ready. Yep. Later, Bell. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Take my hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. <laughs> 